Alan MacDonald finds Bailey playing in the number nine shirt in the absence of Ferdinand today. Goss turns and oh that's fallen for Penrise great chance and he chips the keeper but he's just put it over and that was the chance for Rangers to get the goal that they've looked like scoring because they've been the better team no doubt about that in the opening quarter of the match Crook oh nicely laid down by Sutton who got it back from Goss Sutton again to Robbins David Phillips has arrived as well oh great touch marvellous bit of football by Mark Robbins a one-handed save by Stagecall onto the crossbar Now here's Sutton, got away from Peacock who's pushed him over, it must be a penalty. It was shoulder to shoulder between him and the young 19 year old Chris Sutton. Sutton got the better of it and as he tried to break away from the number five, Peacock did everything he could to lean on him and make it as difficult as possible. And when Sutton went down you feel the referee had no alternative. Norwich with a chance to get the goal, if they can beat Stasekul. Bowen from the spot, Norwich lead 1-0 and are they on their way to the top of the Premier League? Holloway, great ball, this is Bailey. Oh, it's an own goal, is it? No, it came back off the underside of the crossbar. How on earth did that stay out? Ian Culverhouse in front of his own goal, lashed at that and he smashed it against the underside of the bar and it looks all ends up an own goal but somehow it came back out Robbins, Goss Such whipped in, Sutton's header great goal what a fine goal by young Chris Sutton scored both goals in the Coca-Cola Cup tie against Carlisle recently. Chris Sutton took up a terrific position for that header. He just got inside the defender Darren Peacock and he met it perfectly. Stagecall couldn't even move his feet. Holloway. This is Ray Wilkins trying to get something going desperately for Queen's Park Rangers. Here's Bradley Allen. He must score. He has. The substitute makes an almost instant impact on the game. He's only been on a couple of minutes, Bradley Allen. Came on as a replacement for Gary Penrice. And he nicked that away as Brian Gunn came streaming off his goal line and had the composure to keep calm and not make a mess of a, a good opportunity. And that's now given Rangers something to chase with just over 10 minutes left to play. Queen's Park Rangers have only suffered one league defeat away this season. That was against Chelsea. Bardsley whipped right across. wide enough for Brian Gunn and didn't really make the keeper stretch but it's a spirited end to the match by QPR here's Sutton he's got between the defenders Sutton towed it well wide and that's the last kick Norwich remain unbeaten at home and have now taken 16 points from 18 